One of the things that I have lamented, Rob, over the past little while, besides, particularly when it comes to the DCEU universe, mm. I love Ben Affleck as Batman. Broke my heart when we found out he wasn't going to be Batman anymore. He was great. I loved him as Batman. But Henry Cavill, and I know it's almost sacrilege to say Henry Cavill is my all-time favorite Superman. I do not believe he is coming back to play Superman. Uh, when asked about it, instead of saying, oh, yeah, we're, yeah, we, yeah, we're definitely going to... No, Warner Brothers didn't even pretend to lie. They're like, we have no plans for, for, for Superman at the moment. But this is interesting. Just heard about this this morning. Henry Cavill... While not saying Warner Brothers is committed to still having him as Superman, he has come out and he is saying that personally, he's not done. He doesn't consider himself done for this. He, As far as he's concerned, he's still got it. Here's some of the things he was saying. He said the cape is in the closet. That's a term they've used before. That's a term that his, his um, publicist used before months and months and months ago. The cape is still in the closet. It's still mine. I'm not just going to sit quietly in the dark as all this stuff is going on. I've not given up the role. There's a lot I have to give for Superman yet. A lot of storytelling to do. A lot of real, true depths to the honesty of the character I want to get into. I want to reflect on the comic books. That's important to me. There's a lot of justice to be done for Superman. The status is... You'll see. Now, th then they go on to write, the actor was also asked for an honest seven to three films, and he said, Man of Steel, a great starting point. Not just a great starting point, Henry. It's a magnificent film. Man of Steel is a magnificent film. If I were to go back, I don't think I'd change anything. Batman versus Superman? Mm, very much a Batman movie. And I think that realm of darkness is great for a Batman movie. Justice League? It didn't work. Now, he then goes on to say, well, I mean, there, there was more in another iteration of the interview, but... Basically, Rob, what we've got here is Henry Cavill saying that he hasn't given up. I love, I like the wording of that. There's a lot I have to do, but I haven't given up on this. I'm just not going to sit quietly in the dark while this stuff's going on. I've not given up the role. I think, I think the wording here is important because I don't see anything in here that is suggesting to me that, yeah, me and Warner Brothers, we're still on the same page and we're going to move forward and make more Superman movie together. I don't see that in his comments. But even though that's not there, as an individual who does not think that Henry Cavill will play Superman again, but God, I am desperate to see Henry Cavill play Superman again. I mean, and the, look, I, this doesn't give me a lot of hope because it's just, I need Warner Brothers to say this stuff. Right. So it doesn't give me a lot of hope, but at least gives me some. Because, again, I adore Henry Cavill's portrayal as the Man of Steel. I think he portrayed a borderline perfect Superman, understanding we've got a Kal-El in a modern-day context, not the 1950s and the 1960s, and what would his world be like and how would it look like to him. I thought his portrayal of it has been bang on. Fantastic. I just love this guy. And I would love to see it. So I'm not going to get overly excited about this comment. Because, again, I need to hear Warner Brothers saying, yes, we are still committed to Henry Cavill as our Superman, which they have never said. And even when given the opportunity to say it, they passed on it. That's important to keep in mind. But I at least like hearing this. This is at least good, isn't it, Rob? Or am I getting my hopes Dude, up for I, nothing? I, first of all, I like that he comes out and flat out says, I like Man of Steel. You yeah, know, I love that. Proud of Man <laughs> of Steel. He, I, I'm tired. You and I defend staunchly defend Man of Steel. So did Schnepp, by the way. Uh, we, we're Man of Steel lovers. I, I think, John... On the heels of this, I, I'm expecting a tweet any moment now. Hashtag Henry Cavill says, release the Snyder Cut. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I, I don't know. I, look, he hasn't said that. By the way, I I don't want to step no, into it. But he a, has spoken about that. Did, did you remember his comment from a couple months ago about how there's no point? Remember yeah, him yeah. saying that? I, just wanna, I don't want to get into some quagmire I'm never going to get myself out of. But, but I think this is great. And, you know, I thought Henry Cavill was great as Superman. And I thought he was great in Man of Steel when he really wasn't Superman yet. You know, I, I was I was looking forward to seeing his journey to becoming Superman. Uh, in Batman v Superman, there wasn't enough of him. And of course, Justice League, I thought he got I thought he got done dirty. But I would love to see another Man of Steel film as a follow up uh, because I think it would be great. And I love hearing him say this. I think Henry Cavill's one of our great unsung actors. I think he's going to make Witcher an incredible show to watch. You and I have expressed our love of Man from Uncle. 
So oh, I would. God, I love Man from I Uncle. I mean, him and Army Hammer was so good. <laughs> Great chemistry. So that movie is so underrated. And now to hear him say this, somebody give that man a Superman movie. You know what? They gave Captain Marvel a shield again. Somebody give Henry Cavill a Superman movie. Captain now. America Shield again? Yeah, when get this man a shield. When he went to you know when 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 oh yeah no when Black you Panther said Captain said, Marvel a shield. But yeah, I say Captain Marvel. But, uh, but I but I get it. I mean Captain America, get this man a shield. Get Henry Cavill a a, a Man of Steel movie. Get another. Why is there why is there no? We get Joker movie. We get another Batman movie. and We still don't have another Superman movie. Come on, I, man. I know. Like they still are scratching their heads over Warner Brothers one two. And listen, we got to remember Henry Cavill. It's not like he just suddenly burst onto the scene. Henry Cavill is a guy that all the talent agents had circled for years before you and I ever heard his name because they knew this guy's got it. Yeah. This guy has it. He was the runner-up to play James Bond. He lost that out to Daniel Craig, so we still never heard of Henry Cavill. Back when they were doing Superman Returns that went to Brandon Routh, and I love Brandon Routh as Superman. I, re- I love Brandon Routh. I do too. But Henry Cavill was the runner-up at that time. They have been looking at him and circling this guy as a cannot-miss blue-chip prospect for absolute superstardom, and he is not disappointed. Right from when he was in the Tudors, uh, moving on, and I loved him as Superman, Man from Uncle. You put this dude in anything, I will eat it up, and I would love to see him back again. This is not Warner Brothers saying that we have plans to use him again. No. And we do have to remember that Warner Brothers was given the opportunity to affirm Henry Cavill as their Superman. And all they chose to say is, we love Henry Cavill, but right now we have no plans for for Superman. So they gave the most worst non-answer ever, ever in history. But man, wouldn't it be great? I still don't think he will be back. But oh my God, wouldn't it be great? <sighs> I'm just going to sit here and hope quietly. I'm just going to sit here and hope quietly. Question is, guys, how are you feeling about these comments from Henry Cavill at this point? Do you think there's something to be excited about? Are you like, uh, until Warner Brothers says something, there's nothing to be excited about. What do you guys think? Jump down to the comments section below and leave us your thoughts. All right.